Good evening from Mexico and welcome back to my YouTube channel. So I wanted to do another story time where I told you guys the story of one of the times, something, not one of the times, but something from me and my husband's past. So the story that I wanted to tell you was the day that he proposed. So my husband and I have been together for 13 years now and we've been legally married for four of those years. However, when Diego was between four and five years old, my husband actually proposed to me. And it had been a really, really long day at work. And I was in a terrible, terrible mood. And Fidel had been working out of town um, in another state. And he had just come back. It was the day after Valentine's Day. And it's funny because I remember being a little upset because everybody that I worked with got flowers and all kinds of stuff for Valentine's Day. And I didn't get any of that, which was Fidel's normal thing. And now doesn't seem very important, but it was his normal thing. And I didn't get any of that because he was actually out of town. And so I was on my way home from work and I remember calling Fidel and he had picked up Diego from daycare and he was so excited. He said, what do you want to do for dinner? Uh, do you want to make something? And I remember I was so incredibly grumpy and, and I told him, uh, no, I don't want to do any of that. Let's just order pizza. And he was like, well, I think maybe we should do something nice for dinner. And I was like, no, we're just going to order pizza. And I was adamant on it. And I remember getting really upset because, uh, you know, we have long days like that. And um, I got upset and told him, uh, I don't understand why we can't just get pizza. <laughs> and then I remember we, he told me, okay, that's fine. We'll just do pizza. And I told him, all right, I'll see you when I get home. And I was so close to getting home. And I walked up the stairs to our apartments and I walked into my apartment and there were a bunch of candles lit everywhere. And Diego was holding this bouquet of roses. And my husband was sitting, or he was standing by the kitchen table. And on the kitchen table was a bear and it was a Valentine's Day bear with the year on its foot. And there were more flowers and chocolates. And sitting right in front of the bear was a ring. And we had always talked about getting married. Um, and so I knew that it was going to happen, but he had never actually proposed. And I honestly didn't I mean, we had been living together and we had Diego together and that. I didn't think that I was going to get some big romantic gesture. But I remember looking around and the entire house was clean. And Diego looked so excited. And Fidel took the ring off the table. And Diego said, Dad wants to know if you'll marry him. <laughs> and... I remember crying a lot and I remember apologizing a lot because I was such a jerk on the way out <laughs> when I talked to him. Um, and I remember it not being big and, and grand, but being absolutely perfect. So this was a shorter story, um, but it's one of my favorites. And there are a lot of little moments in, in our relationship that remind me of why I'm spending my life with this man. And I think that that is definitely a testament to one of them. So um, <clears throat> don't forget that you can email me at 2 laurita 70 tu as in Spanish, um, at gmail.com. That is down in the description of this. You can also follow me on my, all of my social media platforms, uh, including TikTok at uh, Lawarita70, on Instagram at underscore Lawarita70. But please don't forget to subscribe. Drop your questions, comments below. And I look forward to hearing from each and every one of you. And I hope that you'll stay tuned for another story time. Bye, guys.